The report by ABC News correspondent Bob Serkin dealt with all aspects of the missing children's case, but perhaps the most sensitive issue, at least as far as Atlanta police are concerned, was Serkin's contention that investigators from the missing children's task force are simply not keeping up with the tips they're receiving. That's because the task force is so understaffed and overwhelmed by the volume of calls that frequently only the first call about an incident is written up, no matter how many more calls come in about that incident. Top criminal investigators around the country tell us this is no way to run a major investigation. Let me say that the coverage that was given to the investigation, in my estimation, was outrageous. Atlanta Public Safety Commissioner Lee Brown was quick to respond. He called the report biased and negative and says it was a waste of his and the rest of the police bureau's time. I personally spent a half an hour of my time being interviewed by them. Not one second of that was reflected in their program. I'm asking my attorneys, can I bill them on behalf of the city for that time that they've taken, which we would not mind if it was used in some constructive way. Brown also they defended investigators from the task city. force, saying they are keeping Again, up with the calls position, they're receiving. In fact, he says the phone company has been called in to design a more sophisticated input certain, system to handle the volume. However, Brown admitted that investigators are probably not following up on 100 percent of the calls they receive. There's a certain amount of discretion involved with that, he says. Producers for 2020 say they stand behind their report 100%. At the Atlanta Police Bureau, B.B. Emmerman, Action News.